Brothers of Metal. And a prophecy of Ragnarok. That was horrible. Shout out to our boy, Rin. <laughs> you didn't expect it to be I did, did not. <laughs> it was, it's too much. I liked it, though. Let's check it out. Let's get it. He heard his name and then he came running in here. <laughs> his evil plan was to lick Chuck's face. Isn't that yep. right, Loki? I like this song a lot. I really enjoyed it. It's got a really nice feel to it. It's, Banger and a half right here, guys. Um, The metal and steel, fire and ice threw me off because fire and ice are opposites. Metal and steel are not. Okay, agreed. Okay, uh, that's fair. That's fair. Um, I saw you were also confused about the mistletoe. Yeah. I am. His downfall was a mistletoe? I don't know who the God yeah, of Light well, is, first off. Um, well, okay, so I get it confused a lot because God of War, it was Balder, I believe, that um, could only be harmed with mistletoe. Okay. So they, like, made mistletoe arrows. Oh, okay. To kill him. Interesting. I can't remember if it's Balder, though, um, it, like the actual God that had that, or if it was a different one, and God of War just did a change-up. 
So okay. I get I get that confused a lot. Yeah, see, I don't know much about like Norse mythology, like the more in depth parts of it. Obviously, the typical ones like oh, no. Thor, Loki, and Odin, but that's about it. Thor, Loki, Odin, Baldur. Um, Freya, Freyr, her brother. Oh, I didn't know she had a brother. Yeah. Um, Hell. I'm, I'm probably forgetting a bunch. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure. Mogi. Done, but I don't know a majority of them. Um, that being said, that was. Tear. That's a big one. Oh, who's that? Well, he's also got a, uh, for a god in Forgotten Realms. Oh. So I thought maybe you heard him because of Dungeon Dragons. Hmm. Apparently not, though. Mm-mm. I mean, I've heard the name Tear. Yes. But I don't know where you got it from. Yeah, right. that's fair. Song itself was a banger, dude. It had nice ups and downs, peaks and valleys, vocals, fire, writing, well done. Besides metal and steel. Yeah. Which uh, is going to make the song like a one. Because, as Chuck pointed out, metal and steel make a lot of noises. Which is definitely not what they're talking about here. <laughs> I figured they were going to see. So right after that, they were talking about they all were repelled. I thought I figured they were going for opposites there with the fire and ice repelling. Maybe it's because it was snowing and the fires from lava or not lava, a uh, hot oil and fire arrows. And then the metal and steel would be the battle. I mean, maybe because right after that, it was was thrown at his naked brow. They were repelled no matter the might. You repel someone from the, attacking a castle, for, for example? Yeah, I mean, you 100% could be right there. Don't fuck with the murder holes, man. They'll get you. They'll get you every damn time. Won't they? <laughs> oh, hell yeah, dude. Fucking a uh, little bit of hot oil s- s- just pouring on you. Oh, you're done. You're done. You're frying alive in your armor. Mm-hmm. It's not good. Not good Not at all. Not good at all, guys. Um, I will say the only other downfall that I have with this, which doesn't affect it at all, because it was such a fun tune, mm-hmm. was the fact that it was four line, four choruses repeating, and that was it. Okay. Um, but fair. outside of That's that, fair... it was very fun, upbeat. I enjoyed the energy in it, and yeah, makes me want to learn more Norse mythology. It's intriguing. But they didn't really have a written history, so a lot of it's told stories. A lot of it's actually written from Christians' perspective because okay. they were literate, and when they were coming into the Norse lands, they knew how to write. So it was all from the point of view of missionaries. That's why a lot of Vikings were scary. Oh, okay. Because they were, you know, they did slaughter some monks and stuff. But yeah. You'll have that. You'll have that with any. Yeah, empire. Yeah, yeah. yeah. From the back of there. Absolutely, but this is how we're rating it. Um, I'm gonna rate it at a. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do a seven point three playlist. Uh, I'm gonna go with a flat A here playlist. Shout out to Rin. Great pick, bud. Absolutely. Uh yeah. 